Good morning vlog and welcome back to my channel. How is everybody? It's a lovely Monday morning and I hope you're all well. I don't know how I feel about my new glasses. It's a bit of a love-hate relationship, but they match my outfit today. I'm wearing these pink leggings. Um, I don't know if you can see them. They are these ribbed leggings. Is it showing? Yeah, um, and I absolutely love them. I've been wearing them all weekend. I got this pair and a black pair. I'll try and get a photo for Instagram where you can see them better. Um, but I got this pair as well as a black pair that I've been working, wearing for work all weekend. And I love them. They're the comfiest and I wish you could feel them. They're so soft. Anyway, um, I'm going to put the kids' clothes on. They're here waiting very patiently, both of them. <laughs> My babies. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to put their clothes on and we are going to go down to the beach. So, yeah. And I'm also going to nip in a shop that there is and hopefully buy some bits. So I might do a little haul after. Um, but yeah, let's put their clothes on. Are you sitting like a good boy? Both of you. Give me a second, I'm just going to get your answers. <coughs> oh, you're such a well-behaved puppy. Aren't you a good boy? He got no, sit still. Tilly's gonna wear pink to match mummy. Oh, whoops. Let's hit the road. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Don't bite faces. I don't like you biting faces. What are you so up, Tom? Like Who are you growling at? Tom? Sat like a big what boy. Is he at? On the seafront. Th yeah. That that lady there we don't like. Mm. Don't you not, Tom? No, Tilly, don't like She wants to go down there. What's up, Tilly? What? What do you want? Go on, Till. No, she's sidetracked. What? Do you want to go on the beach? You want to go on the beach? Oh, she's clearly telling you, isn't she? she What's up to? to? Go on the sand. Tilly's got her own way, as usual. Oh, Tilly! <laughs> you little. You, oh, Tilly! It's she, madam. What's up, Tills? Oh, she loves it. The beach baby. Come on then. Now you've got your own way. This is soft Tom, isn't it? Compared to the Costa Cabana. <laughs> Have you seen them all? <laughs> oh, how close can I walk to the sea Tilly, have you got weight to do a footprint? Look, Tills, watch. Tilly! Come on, Tills. You haven't. No, no, I haven't. See ya, see ya. Woo! Sugar. Tilly! Tom! Are you doing a footprint? Hang on, I'm all tangled. Go on, Tills, go and do a footprint with Tom. Quick! The water's gonna get ya! Dig, Tom, dig! Oh, he's digging. Go on, Tom! Dig, dig, dig! Oh god, he's proper putting his head in. Oh, Tom, yee! Hey. <laughs> what was that about? <laughs> Come on then. We're not going to get anywhere. Dab. Dab. <laughs> <laughs> She's a little cat. <laughs> that a one. load of scatters. A load of... <laughs> You're like a chicken 
<laughs> Look at Tom, he's doing it now. Ugh, he's spitting it all out. Don't eat it, Tom. Come on, Tom! Oh, look at them both marching on. Okay, so I've just stopped the car because I've um, dropped Mum off at home and I was singing it sounds like a movie, no, what is it? And she's howling. Okay, so she's heartbroken because I've dropped Mum off. She hates coming away from Mum's. Um, let's just see if I can get a towel again because it was hilarious. It looks like a movie. It sounds like a song. My God, this reminds me. Oh, oh, when we were young. Let me photograph you in this light in case it is the last time that we might. something I love so I don't mind let me photograph oh, I don't even know which way to go right, go on. anyway so yeah I don't even know I don't know what to say I don't know what to do what do I say what do I do I'm actually sweating it's so hot by the way my car doesn't have a it's because in Spanish it's a thermometer and in English it's a thermometer so I mix words anyway thermometer haven't got one in the car but it has to be a good 30 degrees like surely I was just listening back to the last clip and I'm sorry like you're gonna have to bear with me I need to learn to talk slower in my videos because I get a bit carried away with myself my babies oh <gasps> babies you're beautiful. Also, um, I've been with the babies since they were six days old. Well, six days with Tilly and about 12 days with Tom. Or 10, I can't, oh, no, it was, it was more than that. I can't, I can't actually remember Oops, how many it is. Um, but I, on Saturday was the first day that I dropped them off at mum's because I had to go to work and I was working from 12 midday and I didn't know it was up till half past 10 at night like was the how long it could have been kind of thing like we didn't close till half 10 at night this car's got its four indicators on for some reason um so I was like well I better drop them off at mum's because it's a lot of hours for two puppies to be by themselves so I did that and then Obviously, I ended. I only ended at half seven or something like that. I came away, but um, the mum guilt that I felt for my little puppies when I left them at mum's, it was so bad. Like I felt so guilty. But do you know what the worst thing was? And I was like, oh my god, imagine if this was an actual child. I went to mum's house at half past seven Saturday evening. She was sat on the settee with the puppies. I spoke to Tilly and she was growling at me like she didn't even want to know me. And I cuddled her and she was biting me like nicking that she wanted me to put her down. I put her down and she went with mum and I was like, the level of betray, like what? I couldn't believe it. She was being such a little madam, to say the least. She was being awful. Weren't your tails? You were being horrible. And even Tom, he was like, but he was super sleepy, so I knew that like he's always excited to see me. But when he's tired, 
he's just dead to the world and then yesterday I dropped them off and I felt even guiltier for some reason because they didn't want to stay like on Saturday they wanted to stay they didn't want to come away and then yesterday they didn't want to stay as I was coming away I probably gave them too many kisses and lovers and they were like nah we're not staying and they were following me and I just I was like oh my babies anyway but then at work I never even thought of them I didn't have time um and then what was I gonna say oh yeah then when I went to pick them up they were playing outside with mom and I just came in the gate and I was like babies because you know that I treat them like <laughs> so I was like Dilly Tom and they came bombing at me jumping up kissing me and oh, oh, my heart was like yeah. I had a little heart moment did to Tom my little baby I love you Tom and then my baby Tiwi Tiwi She's so lovely. My little oh, what's he mean? Tiwi <laughs> Tilly Da da It's the circle The circle of life do, 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 do. And it rules us all I'm gonna pop you on charge because you've no battery. I'm gonna wash my hair because um yeah, I think it's about hair washing. Um, oh, sorry, I'm knackered, I feel like exhausted. So yeah, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna wash my hair, I'll probably change my top. Uh, I've left the puppies playing out, but the front door's open, that's why you can hear a neighbor with a... I don't know what it is in English. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do, and I'm gonna kill the bird <laughs> this is what it does every time someone's talking it's like a competition um i'm gonna rinse the non-slip shower mat basically i washed it in bleach i put it in a bucket of bleach and it's still in a bucket of bleach um mum's messaging me but i'm also um waiting on a horse order from decathlon and i'm so excited we could do a little haul well probably not haul content but we could do one just want to apologise, I'm going to flick the viewfinder down, I keep looking at myself in the viewfinder to see if I'm in shot, what's in shot, whatever, and I'm not looking at you, and that's rude, so I'm sorry about that. These dogs, these birds, everything, oh, God. right, going to see what the puppies are doing, going to wash my hair and all that. just want to again shout out these leggings, they're the comfiest things, look, I don't know if you can see the, um, hang on focus there we go the rib detailing they are so nice so soft and the comfiest things like i love them and then here at the waistband they just say active 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 um they're from lefties i'm gonna see if i can link them down below and i'm gonna try and put them on my insta stories too because i love them okay okay so i'm looking a lot different a lot more fresh face i think um i'm on my way to work it's quarter to four and i'm going at four hang on have i not got my phone on me yeah I have. um i've received an email that my order's ready so i'm really excited because when i've got to work i can go and pick it up hang on did i tell you about that or did i just tell you that i was awaiting an order i think i'll tell you that i was waiting for the order I'm not i'm not sure if i already told you i'm sorry how did um, I have a brain fart moment from now and then every now and again um, but yeah I'm on my way to work going at four it's quarter to four and I'm literally on the doorstep but anyway I'm gonna try and park a bit of a distance away because as soon as I park the parents harass me and I'm like my outside is like oh hi nice to see you nice to have a chat but the outside, the enemy, sorry, is thinking, are you being serious? I do not start my job till four o'clock, so just leave me alone. But what can I say? Um, I felt really guilty coming away from the puppies again. It's just a thing. Basically, not last week, the week before, I was off work for a whole week, so they were just coming out with me everywhere all the time. That's my phone. Um, but then, Yes, today, yeah. Saturday and Sunday they've been with mum all day so they haven't been by themselves. And now I was leaving them again and I felt really good. As soon as they went to the beach this morning and every time they see me getting dressed, they're like, 
on the settee running around like hyper or just waiting sat watching me like we're being really good because we're gonna come with you and i'm like no you're not and then it was half past so i was like okay fair enough play outside a bit so i had them playing out and then it was time to come in i picked it up she was growling at me because she didn't want to go in and tom was like running away from me and i feel really guilty but anyway it's just a little bit of guilt i know they'll be fine <sighs> my horrible boy has turned up i can just see his dad pulling in um well yeah um i know that they'll be fine that it's just me um money 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 cuddling them money. whatever it's just me faffing over them but the guilt's there anyway i'm gonna just scroll on my phone for a minute and then i will go in i've got like six more minutes so i'm gonna do my best also i'm gonna have a drink because i feel dehydrated oh my god should that really be driving through here well anyway see you in a little bit see you on the other side if i make it okay so god let me take this off i have just got out it's um seven o'clock the lighting's changed since i went in um i'm out of breath it's 10 past seven i was a bit late because um i finished my lesson but there's a mum that's always late to pick the kids up and because it's last hour and it's the hour that i come away i feel really guilty leaving them with the receptionist which they don't really know and they're only uh four and five year olds so i don't think it's really fair to come away oh my god my spot i don't think it's really fair on them for me to come away and leave them with someone they don't know uh, i even have mum guilt of the kids that aren't even mine well kids puppies kids you know babies um so yeah <sighs> i'm exhausted i'm gonna see whoops if i go and pick up my order i've been thinking about it all afternoon I just really hope it fits my horse. Fingers crossed. See you in a minute. Okay, okay. So now it's time for the big box. I just put myself in the mouth. I don't know if I can just get into it or if I have to. Am I gonna have to? I don't want to have to. Okay, it's got a pull thing. Stop being thicker. Oh, this is so satisfying. Sorry. That's not how this works. This is so satisfying. Da 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 da. Literally, such a box for just two bits. But anyway. Okay, so firstly, we have flicking heck these way. They actually look quite big. I'm gonna link these down below. I think they were like ten euros. I hope I'm not getting that wrong, but I've got a feeling that they were 10 euros and if they were, they're so sturdy. You're da -da -da -da. I'm just like looking for people all the time. Um, no, yes, they were 20 euros. Okay, that's more like it. They were 20 euros. Um, and they are these um, iron stirrups. I think they're iron. I feel it's iron, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. Uh, um, no, it isn't. It's like silver wait it's stainless steel that's the one stainless steel stirrups oh my god i hope like wow they are so gorgeous and then they have the logo here if it will focus no it won't focus because my face hang on beauty guru beauty guru oh my god it will not focus there we go it's got the um logo there on the stirrups but how gorgeous are they wow and they have such a good grip and they weigh a ton which is like in a good way though there were also plastic ones on store really cheap but why would you want plastic syrups i feel like that's just like a bit silly but sorry that's maybe just me being ignorant i then got my um stirrup leathers these are the 155 centimeter which are 57 inch and these were 15 euros which also for like leather i think that's so cheap and then they're also nylon nylon on the inside with big buckles hang on am i being thick here what the heck's that for or is that just to keep it together until i get it on the saddle surely yeah it is okay it's me being thick is it 
Oh my god, my camera keeps running out of space. So that's just me being thick. I think I'm pretty sure it's just whilst you get it on the saddle, like it's to keep the buckles together because it's where both buckles are. I, I'm gonna say that. <laughs> okay, so that's that. I'm gonna put it back in its packaging because you know this saddle is gonna be looked after. And then we have the girth, and this is a hell of a girth. What size did I get? I'll let you know. This is the da, 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 the black. It's twenty one ninety nine, and I'm, I think it was the ninety eight, or is it one meter something? I have no idea. I also need. Oops. I also need to study my English horsey vocabulary because I have no idea. This is gorgeous. I hope you can see the detailing of the leather on here. Can you see that? It's like a bit like a snake effect. The vocals rattle and then it has that for in case you want to put uh, I don't know my English Spanish horse vocabulary, okay? Your <laughs> pecho pedral, whatever that is in English. Um, and yeah, I think this is such a good and it feels really sturdy as well. But not sturdy as in oh, solid, but like thick. Do you know what I mean? Like good material. Um, does it have a size on it here? The 105 centimeters. That was the one. Um, basically, I measured Flossie and I, was, I measured her to the middle of the the middle of the, her six buckles on the saddle, and I was like, "There, if I want to put it on anyone else, I can put it on bigger because she's the smallest one." Not yeah, without the fall. So yeah, I'm gonna go and pick my saddle up, and I'm gonna go and try it on Floss. So I might show you, and if not, I'll show you another day. I actually might ride tomorrow with the English saddle. That would be cool okay so it's a lot later on now it's actually really late it's half past midnight and i'm gonna have a shower and get ready for bed um i really hope you enjoyed the vlid the vlid the video because it's a vlog video the vlog if you did a smash the thumbs up subscribe down below if you haven't already i'm literally knackered but anyway um i'll see you tomorrow with a new vlog Fingers crossed. Go wash my face and get ready for bed because I look a mess. And I'm going to start editing the video. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in tomorrow. Night night.